back at my spot, my uh, Confederate camp. Uh, just got here. First thing I dug was this piece of piece of chain. That's pretty cool. And, uh, and then like two feet from that, I got a, another sharps. Looks like an eye base sharps. Yep. Man, that's got a hell of a protruding eye on it. Look at that. Golly. This area is full of these eye base sharps. Um, then another area I found a bunch of dimple base sharps. And a lot of Colt pistol bullets around here too. I haven't had targets ring up like this in a while. Um, but it was another eye base sharps anyway. But it was only like three inches down. So that's probably why it was ringing so good. But I'm in really mineralized soil. This is really, really red, nasty stuff. But I made a change to the AT Pro. And um, I don't know if this has anything to do, anything to do with it, but it, it just seems to me like I've got signals coming up so much more clearer than before. Um, I, I was on one of the, the forums one time, and a guy had made a comment about um, uh, the frequency. You know, this, this has four different frequency modes. I've always wondered if, it, if the frequency frequency had anything to do with the soil conditions but anyway this this guy made a comment one time and he says put it on f2 dig stuff all kinds of deep and all this stuff but you know how these guys are a lot of these guys that have the at pros that's they swear by them and the funny thing is they've never used anything else before so how in the hell do they even know but anyway i put it on f2 and i think i used to use f4 before that but i put it on f2 f2 and, and I, honestly it probably was no different than when i had it on f4 but anyway i've had a really rough time digging in this this spot and um i just thought you know what <clears throat> let me try to mess with these frequencies a little bit just to see if it has something to do with you know if it, it helps out in soil conditions and um i put it on f1 and it, I swear to God, it seems like the signals just come up so much more clearer. Uh, call me crazy. I don't know. Maybe it's something to it. Maybe it's not. I don't know. But I'm, I just, I, t I swear to God, I think, I think it helped. I think F1 just performs better in this really hard, nasty, mineralized soil. But anyway, if uh, any of you guys have any experience, experiences with the frequencies and soils and things like that, maybe, uh, you can enlighten me a little bit. I'm going to see if I can dig a few more of these bad boys today. All right, here we go again. Now, I made the comment that I had switched my machine over. I changed the frequency over to F1 because uh, just to see how it performed in this, in this soil because this is really, really hard. Sig I mean, if you guys know what, have experienced call pepper, you know that this soil is just crazy, crazy mineralized. Um... But anyway, I put on F1, and I'm getting signals ringing up like crazy. I've been digging bullets like I've never dug before here. And they're coming up. I mean, I don't know if the sun, you can't see it because the sun's glaring. But Yeah, it's somewhere down in there. Oh, damn, watch out, wormy. Get you in a good spot. There you go. Maybe it's not a bullet. Maybe it's something larger. Uh, I'm going to have to get the shovel. I'm not down far enough. Yeah, I got it. It's over here. There it is. What? No, that's not it. There it is. What is it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah, it's another uh, Sharps. This one's a dimple, dimple base. I've dug two eye base just a few feet from here. And then this, uh, this guy. I'm telling you what, man, the frequency has something to do with soil. I'm messing with your frequencies in soil and see if it doesn't make a big difference because I was having a very hard time digging these bullets out of here. I mean, everything sounded like square nails unless it was right on top of the ground. But anything with a little depth to it, just forget it but i'm these things are ringing up screaming clear now this is amazing another dimple base sharps i mean they're popping out of the ground like crazy man this is great 
it's just really thick it's just so thick i can't get you know i can't cover a lot of ground but all right now i've been hunting this place for a while now and i found tons of sharps carbines i found dimple base i found flat base and i found eye base sharps and i've never found a ringtail sharps until now look at that i just dug a freaking ringtail that's amazing it's funny because they're all grouped in a certain area 